Let's continue on. Alright. Oh yeah, you can dual wield. Yeah, you're gonna see the same kill move over and over, so... I'll go sword and shield. Hey, one of the things. Don't think I found the original five of them, so. We're just exploring around, you know? Just Where to go? Oh, there we go. Here's something. Camera's going nuts. There we go. Got him down. Four out of five, so. Eh. Oh, the, the, the guy's in the way. Let's see if we'll move. Oh, that's always good. Don't you just love when you're a when the friendly AI just blocks your path? Maybe that wasn't friendly. This goes downstairs. I need to go downstairs. I need to go up. Or do I? I don't know. I'm not seeing any way up more. It was, I think this is just for the coffer. There's screen tearing in this game on a console. That's why I say it's not I don't think it's made for consoles. Hellgate is made. Stop us with the dungeon. 
Cal Gaze is fleeing into the dungeon. Stop it! Get him with a crossbow. I don't think I was supposed to do it like that, but you know how to wield a blade. Now, let's see if you can wield fire half as well. Yours, his nightmare. The Spaniard might be surprised. To me, your powers are commonplace. Then you are damned as well. <laughs> Two bearers of the curse. But it makes no difference. I was supposed to have a sword here, you could tell. I will not allow you to claim what I've spent my life to protect. Am I still in a nightmare? Or did you really just see my life? It is a nightmare, but it's more real than you might think. Stand up and fight if you want to live. You got a Caballero. I'll fight with you. I owe you my life, but you owe me an explanation. I will answer all of your questions later. For right now, let us drive this demon back together. This will be your grave. It's really hard to select, like the top one there. There we go. I never imagined Boniface would send a bearer of the curse. You seem to have mastered its effects very well. Who are you, mercenary? I am no mercenary. In my veins flows the blood of the Templars. The blood of the De Bale family. De Bale, you say? Then you are the son of Jean De Bale. Ah, I understand now why your father had so much faith in you. What? You know of my father? You must tell me! Martin, it's been a long time. Boniface de Montferrat. When I heard that Marois was assaulting my castle, I knew at once that he worked in your shadow. You are relieved of your service, mercenaries. Marois, take them to the encampment and pay them generously. The battle is won. My lord, this man... I have spoken. Your job here is done. What? What do you mean? Leave us before the coffers are emptied and you miss out on your share. Let's go, Esteban. My old friend, dear old Martin. I know you've hidden the relic somewhere in this castle, but you would sooner die than put it into my hands, would you not? I will make sure that is exactly what happens. You fool. Do you think I'm stupid enough to have kept it here? 
I gave it to a man who deserved it. More than I. But I have seen the sun shine greater than even that night. Boniface, you imbecile! Sir. Ah, enough of your blasted riddles. Who is the sun you speak of? Tell me, Martin. Your hatred of the world will bring you to your dumb eyes. You'll talk, or you'll die! De Bale. Where is the young De Bale? You gave him notice, my lord. He took his gold and left with that Spanish friend of his. What? Damn. Did he say anything about where he was going? Be at ease, sire. Benz de Bale is going to the Chateau de Cree to take part in the jousting tournament. It seems he wants to enlist in the forthcoming crusade. The Chateau de Cree. So... The young de Bale seeks his father, who never returned from Jerusalem, and the crusade is his shot in the dark. He must know where to look. That is... excellent. Hey, a rank. Oh yeah, this. Right. Strength. And there we go. Yeah. That'd be good, right? I don't know. Thirty minutes each episode. Yeah. Sounds good. Maybe fifteen would be better. I don't know. This game has weird pacing. Benz, wait! Are you sure you want to do this? The Crusade is the only hope I have of finding my father. If I want to enlist, this tournament is my best option. So you're going to fight, all to make the other caballeros notice you? Yes, but it is a jousting tournament, and I will have to declare my knighthood to enter. Uh, aren't you going to need a squire? Every knight worth his salt has one. Esteban, I've enjoyed our camaraderie, but our journey together ends here. Good luck. Ah... Uh. Sires, hear ye, kind lords and valiant warriors. The duels have been concluded. Today begins the two on two games. Registration is now ah, open. See, that's destiny. Yes, it seems destiny has a sense of humor. But has destiny brought me the squire I need? Oh, come on. My blades thought they had already proven their worth. And you will not find a better sparring partner, hombre. I am listening, young lord. I am Denz de Bale, son of Jean de Bale. I wish to enlist in the tournament. Very well, my lord. Uh, who shall be your companion of arms? This man. His name is Esteban Noviembre. So be it. So Denz de Bale and Esteban Noviembre have been enrolled in the tournament. May success and fortune be upon you. Tell me, Secretary, is it true that the Lord of Villa Hardois is recruiting for the Crusade? At the behest of His Holiness Pope Innocent III, Fouque de Neuilly himself has come to preach the Crusade's want of able men. 
And undoubtedly, young lord, uh, this tournament in particular is the occasion to draw the eyes of venerable benefactors to your plane. Excellent. Thank you. So, partners once again? Uh, one last thing, my lord. Uh, if you hope to succeed, you may want to take a moment before the tournament begins to practice with the other participants. It's possible you'll find an occasion to learn new moves that way. Uh, you and your companion shall be called forth when your turn comes. Who's next? Are there no other valiant knights willing to do battle? Well, let's review the basics. And when your adversaries are parrying all your blows, you can use a guard break to breach their defenses. A guard breaker, eh? Try it on your opponent. You'll see. A word of caution, Esteban. If you use a guard break on an enemy that is not... ...you'll have no trouble avoiding your attack. It hadn't even crossed my mind. All right. B is guard break. Now begins the melee trials. Here enter the Lord Dens de Bale and his companion of arms, Esteban Noviembre. Their adversaries will be the Lords Antonius de Fougere and Caribert de Montségur. Look up there, Esteban, in the box. That is Geoffroy de Villehardois. He chooses who goes and who stays. I must shine if I want to get recruited. I've got a bad feeling about this crusade thing, old man. But I have a debt to repay. I'll help you shine. Come on! Hey, an upgrade, one-handed weapons, or one-handed sword. Now let's review another technique, the deflection counter. Deflection what? Never heard of it. You can deflect the attacks of your enemies in order to gain the advantage of a counter strike. Once your opponent has lost his balance, you have a small window of time to strike. It may even be a lethal blow. Oh, really? Let's try it. Weird how they have the trial. Here are the combatants. Here are the last round's winners. The Lord Dens de Bale and his companion of arms, Esteban Noviembre. And to face them, please welcome the Lord Trasamund de Casaneuve and his faithful companion of arms, Theoderic de Tomp. We have to win. We're counting on you. Have no fear.
If the guard break allows you to penetrate your opponent's defenses, you should know that your enemies will not hesitate to use it again. They wouldn't dare. Prepare to dodge your adversary's guard break. That move is dangerous, Estevan. Guard break. You'll be momentarily stunned. It's kind of hard to dodge that. Alright, I think I got it. Or at least a general. It's weird how they have the tutorial like 30, more than 30 minutes in. Here are the two time winners, Lord Dens de Bear and his faithful companion, Esteban Noviembre. And to cross blades with them, Lord Alaric de Pierre and his companion, Lord Avidus de Rochebaron. That one didn't go so well. Weapons can't withstand continuous combat. After a while, they break. Really? Do you think so? Yes. These things are not built to last. When a weapon is broken, the damage it inflicts is much weaker. More importantly, some moves become impossible to perform. So be careful. Ay, ay, ay! I wouldn't want us to lose the tournament because of a broken sword. A beautiful weapon. It shines. There's only one fight left, Esteban. Victory is at hand. It's as if the laurels were All right. beyond your ears, hombre. Let the fourth and final round of the many trials begin! Ida, it's him! Here he comes, already ordained as a high baron of the Holy Crusade, Baudouin de Flandre and his companion, Ergo de Landreville! And, any suggestions? Yes, let's win. They give us broken weapons? Stroke of misfortune. It seems our champions, the size the Bale and Noviet, have drawn the broken weapons. I think we're playing on relatively easy. You think you're better than me, DeBail? Never! This isn't over yet! I don't like these odds. No, Esteban. Consider this an opportunity to show them what we're made of.
Don't defeat me! What a surprise! Ah, uh, not this again! You're going to make it, Esteban. Victory is ours! So this is how you overcame their gaze. You, too, belong to the masquerade! Just a little beat up. Ah, oh, crap, press the wrong button. worthy. Go, treat with him, and offer him what he wants. His chance to join our army. As you wish, my lord. Will we also need his companion? The old Spaniard? Yes, but I can't recall his name. September, I think. Or December. A month in the year. Good to bail. Good. Esteban, I know I've asked you to help me earn my place in the Crusader army, and I thank you for that. Help me understand, amigo. What is this curse? Why do I see the burnt men and the flaming skeletons? Don't worry. We will free ourselves from the curse. We will find a way. Oh. I think before I just never used this. Sire Noviembre? Ah, Sire. I like the way that sounds. How can we be of service? The Lord Geoffroy de Villehardois, master of this castle, wishes to inform you, Sires, that you are invited to join the ranks of the very saintly army that departs for Jerusalem tomorrow. You are also invited to his encampment outside town from where the army shall depart. Thank you. Where is that encampment? I don't think I did very good. I got hit a bunch. Still gave me an A rank. All right. Spear, I don't know. Y, Y, X, X, all right. X, X, Y, Y. Uh, y, 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 X, all right. Let's lock another one, why not? And this. What's this? Just a bunch of X's. Okay, that's just a bunch of X's. Y, 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 X, X. All right. Fatalism. All right. How many do we have any other points? Oh, we have one to spend here. Oh, that's definitely something we need. Alright, well, next time. Actually, well, we'll go into the cutscene. Then we'll end it. Oh, the Norton thing came up. I hope that's not going to ruin anything.
So dense. You're serious about this Crusada thing, eh? Yes. The Crusade is the only hope I have to set things right. Help me understand, amigo. Are you trying to strike it rich? Maybe come home with an exotic wife or two? Nothing so trivial. It's my father. Never came home from Jerusalem. Ah. Then your father fought in the Third Crusade. Yes. He was a skilled warrior. I was only a boy when he left to go fight under the Lionheart King's standard. In his absence, well, my uncle, he... Yes? He destroyed my family. He took everything we had. Our home, our land. Only my father can set things right. And I must find him. Wait, wait, Caballero. Let me get this straight. You're telling me that everything we've done until now has been because you believe that one old man will come back from a crusade, or quite possibly the grave, to single-handedly reclaim an entire castle? Are you mad, or just an idiota? My father is the rightful heir. He can make my uncle relinquish what was not his to take. Madre de Dios, help me. He's lost it. Let's get one thing straight, Spaniard. I don't care what you think. And I'm going to find my father. No matter what it takes. And you plan to do that? All while we're being hunted by La Muerte himself. That was an unforeseen complication. You're going to need me in the coming days, I think. Maybe I should accompany you. I don't know if that's such- There they are! Fools! Nobody humiliates Baudouin de Flandre and lives! You'll pay for your offense. In blood! The sea Make will your... run!